What is going on, people of the Smart Society? Matt here from mksmarts.com, and in this video, we're gonna be adding Alexa to our car. So in this video, we're going to be adding uh, Amazon's voice assistant. I don't want to say her name just so that way I don't trigger my own ones in my house as well as yours at home. So we're just going to call it Amazon's uh, voice assistant. So we're going to be adding this to our car so that way we can do different types of commands. Uh, me personally, the one that I'm looking most forward to is controlling music because I have the uh, iPhone and I have CarPlay in my car. But Apple with Siri, they don't let you control Spotify and tell what Spotify song. So I'm hoping that I can control the Spotify selection from this device. But that's not just the only feature. Uh, I'm also excited to use this with my smart home so that way when I pull up to the garage, I can just, hopefully I'll be able to tell it to open the garage doors. We'll have to test that out later and see if that's true. So I'm not, I don't really know what to expect with this video. I kind of just saw this on Amazon's website. It said it was invitation only at the time. I, I believe now anyone can purchase it. But I was like, oh, oh, that looks cool. And it, at the time for the invitation, it was $25. I don't know what the price is now. So I picked this up and this is going to be my video with my experience of it from start to finish. I have no idea what to expect. So we'll see how it goes. But something that I do know what to expect when I receive an order from PCBWay is high quality PCBs. So PCBWay is your one-stop shop for PCB prototyping. They do PCB assembly, PCB prototype, SMD stencil, and a bunch more. They have super quick turnaround times and their customer service is fantastic. So you guys can use the code on the screen now to save $5 off your order and you too can have these high quality PCBs, which I bet you if we opened up the Amazon uh, Echo Auto, we'd find a PCB in here too. PCB Way is the perfect place for all the electronics hobbyists out there as well as businesses too. So head on over to PCBWay.com and pick up a PCB today. And I thank PCB Way for sponsoring this video. All right, let's go ahead and start opening all of this up. So this is the actual uh, Echo Auto here. And then with the invitation, they also provided this like uh, vent mount. I don't know if I can use it in my car because my car has like these directional vents. But we'll go ahead and open this up first. Huh. Oh, here it is. So it's up top here. There we go. Oh, yep. So this is the Echo Air Mount Vent, or the Echo Vent. So this is the mount for the uh, Echo Auto, and you can uh, attach this to your air vents. We'll go ahead and test this out later. Just unbox it right now. Okay, cool. So I think it like magnetically attaches to the Echo Auto here, and then you can use this, rotate it, and stick it into your vent. We'll take a look at that later. And let's get to the actual Echo Auto right here. So there's a tab right here. Oh wow, I didn't think they would include this, but they actually include like the, the adapter for 12 volts to five volts, that's cool. Let's see here, what else do we got? Okay, so you pull this out. You have the actual Echo Auto right here. open that normally people save this for last but we're starting with it right now okay so on the front you have your eight microphones and then on the back if you had the vent clip you can just magnetically attach it that's pretty cool I'll show you guys it in more detail within in a close-up but you also get a 3.5 millimeter cable so male to male and you get a micro USB charging cable right there and you have all of your literature okay so yeah uh it has the echo air mount compatibility on the back and mine is this one right here so the vent won't work or the vent mount won't work my question is how do you attach this oh is there another area right here more stuff that's it huh so one thing that I don't like so far is that there's no way to attach this 
to the actual dash of your car. I was expecting like them to include some type of adhesive or something, but it didn't come with it. So you, I guess you have to figure that out on your own. Huh. I guess we'll have to take a look. All right, well, I'm gonna pull my car into the garage and we'll get this all set up. All right, so I got the Amazon uh, Echo Auto all mounted up. So in the instructions, it said it's not compatible with these types of vents, but I managed to get it to work. I literally just stuck it on the clip and it works. And see, it magnetically sticks on and it's actually pretty stable. I mean, we'll see in the road and going over bumpy roads if it stays, but I mean, like this, it stays. And I also lifted this panel and then I ran the wire through here and then it goes here and then it plugs into the USB port on my radar detector. I didn't end up using the one that comes with the Echo Auto. I just used the USB port here since it was there and I wasn't using it. And I also got uh, the Echo Auto all set up. So let's go ahead and turn on the car. X band. K -band. That's just my radar detector. K -A -band. But the Echo, it should be already. GPS connected. We should, in theory, be all ready to go. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and try something out. Um, Alexa, play Talkie Talkie. Talkie Talkie, featuring Selena Gomez, Ozuna, and Cardi B by DJ Snake. Selena Gomez, Ozuna. Cardi B from Spotify. So my phone is actually connected to the car. That's what I'm using to record. So uh, the clip just cut out, but basically it did start playing. I don't know how far you guys got into it, but it works for what I wanted to. The main reason, and that was to control Spotify. So that's cool. Um, let's see here. What else? Oh, let's go ahead and tell it to open the garage door. Uh, Alexa, set garage door one to zero. Oh, and there you go. It opens up the garage door. Let me just cancel that real quick on this button. Cool. Um, let's try something else. Um, Alexa, add record a video to my to-do list. I've put record a video on your to-do list. Okay. So, yep, that worked. Uh, let's see here. What else is another one? Alexa, tell me a joke. What is a shark's favorite sandwich? Peanut butter and jellyfish. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So the Echo Auto, it I like it so far. I'm going to take it for a test drive and see how it works. All right, so I've just taken the uh, Echo Auto on a quick little test drive to just a nearby parking lot. And I gotta say that even with the music practically uh, all the way up, it was still able to hear me. And I also took it a little bit uh, with other cars and some road noise, and it, it surprisingly picks up really, really well. I didn't get a chance to show you guys around the actual Amazon Echo. So on this side, I think this is either a speaker or a air vent. Here you have the mute mute button and then here you can manually press it and it'll start listing your command and then on this side there is a 3.5 millimeter and a micro usb port where you plug it into charge and on the bottom there's nothing just some feet and on this side there's also really nothing oh uh, let's hope that's not security coming nope okay anyway so yeah overall i'm, I'm so far happy i mean time will tell if how useful it is or not but I'm excited to test it out. Overall, it's been working pretty well. It's doing everything that I originally wanted to when I bought it. All I wanted it to do was control Spotify, control my smart home, and then it's cool so that way when you're driving, you're thinking, because I go on long drives, you can like add stuff to your to-do list, add stuff to your notes and stuff. So that's gonna be really helpful there. I'm gonna insert a clip of pulling up home and then opening the garage door right now all right so i just pulled up home let's go ahead and test out the uh opening the garage door alexa set garage door one to zero hey that works now i can go ahead and pull in 
All right, so thank you guys for watching my video on the Amazon Echo Auto. I'm gonna be playing it around with it and uh, seeing what other cool things I can do with it. Uh, so far, I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, I can't wait to keep testing it out. If you guys wanna pick up an Amazon Echo Auto, I don't believe there you need an invitation anymore. I'll leave a link to it in the description below. All right, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below or head on over to mksmarts.com slash forum where you guys can ask it there. Uh, if you're a smart home enthusiast, join the channel, press the subscribe button, join the Discord, the Discord link is below. And if you guys want any smart home kits, hit up uh, mksmarts.com slash shop. Peace.